Thank you very much, Dr. Langevin. Now we'd like to turn to Dr. George Kuv, National Institute of Alcohol Abuse and Alcoholism. Thanks, Walter and Nora and everyone for including us. Um, alcohol and COVID-19 have a bi-directional relationship and there are four points I'd like to make very quickly. So as, as others have pointed out, isolation and stress associated with the pandemic could lead to uh, pathology in the addiction area, but specifically for us, increased alcohol misuse. So physical distancing can lead to social isolation or loss of social support, which can lead to stress or precipitate relapse for those in recovery. We know that, um, that about two thirds of relapse are caused by stress or stressful events or a stressful negative uh, emotional state. And then physical distancing also uh, poses challenges for treatment and recovery. Telehealth and virtual meetings can be helpful options for individuals in treatment or in recovery from alcohol use disorder. And there are um, a lot of advances being made in, in that regard. Um, the second major area is the biological and behavioral effects of alcohol misuse and, and how they uh, may also exacerbate the pandemic. So um, most of you are well aware that alcohol produces behavioral disinhibition and that can promote risky behavior and less compliance with guidelines to reduce the spread of the virus um, just, th just think of someone in, in an enclosed environment like a bar, taking off their mask or getting too close to someone else um, in uh, speaking loudly and you, you get the picture. And then we know that alcohol compromises immune function, increasing the risk and severity of lung infections. It's well established that alcohol um, pre-pandemic uh, contributes to uh, acute respiratory distress syndrome. And given that that's a major component of serious COVID-19 infection, um, the interaction is certainly one that we're going to be looking at. Um, there are quite a few NIAAA COVID-19 related funding opportunities. As Elaine mentioned, we are part of the mental health uh, uh, supplemental uh, FOAs and, and NOCES, but we're, uh, but we're also um, contributing to RADx RAD through the efforts of Shanghai Kui and, and our staff, and also RADx UP um, through the, the efforts of uh, Trish Powell um, and if you have any specific questions in the discussion about the interaction of alcohol and the immune system, uh, Shanghai Kui is, is going to be on the uh, uh, part of the, uh, the discussion. So thank you very much.